YouTube, how are you doing? And welcome back to Conrad Stevens' Paranormal PI. I am absolutely in love with this game, especially after the last episode where we found probably the coolest story in a ghost hunting game I have ever seen. I highly recommend watching that if you haven't already checked it out. However, in this video, we are also going to be checking out a completely new ghost with a very disturbing story as well. So if you've watched two episodes ago, you know that we went to the crypts to investigate the new ghost, the lady in white that they added to the crypts however we spent like two hours looking around and we didn't find anything at all so then the developer went into the code beepity boopity boop and made the ghost a whole lot more active than it used to be so now supposedly we should be able to find a ton of evidence all around the crypt but i am super excited to check out and that is exactly what we're going to be doing in this video we're going to be playing some conrad stevens paranormal pi i absolutely love this game and i hope you join us if you're not subscribed please do so if you like the video like it if you dislike it dislike it but let's not waste any more time and let's hop into the game. Let's go. Uh, as always, if you've watched this before, you know that when I'm about to start this mission, it's going to start lagging. Also, look at the sheer amount of ghosts. This was the one we found in the last episode, by the way. That was absolutely terrifying. We found a, a cult in the forest that summoned this demon. Then you have Mr. Siegerstein. You got Mr. Lafabre. You got the lady in white, maybe? I think that might be the lady in white. And then you got this. <laughs> I don't know why he's so shaken. But uh, that's the reverend, I think. But anyway, as soon as I click yes, here the game is starting to it's is going to run at like one fps so get ready for that what an incredible opportunity to investigate this location at night there's quite a history here pertaining to the paranormal i'm very grateful pastor rogers reached out although i'm not sure what he'll think if i find some evidence there it regardless fixed. pastor rogers was concerned enough about what he and his parish members have seen to reach out I'm sure I'll be able to find enough evidence to support their claims and put their minds at ease. I was streaming at 1 FPS there. But anyway, here we are on the beautiful church map, uh, which it's a absolutely massive map, which shows you what this game is going to look like in the future. It's going to be an open world ghost hunting game where you can drive around to go to different locations and then visit the haunted locations and investigate ghosts there. So obviously there's the church. We got the first cemetery right here. This place is literally filled with cemeteries. I guess that's what happened when you have an old town. Eventually people move out of the town and all that's left is just cemeteries from the people that died there in the past. It's kind of dark if you think about it. We got the lovely Siegerstein family home. We got the crypt where we can investigate Pierre or Mr. Lafabre. Uh, but we're not doing that today because today we are focused entirely on the crypt. There is, uh, we're three ghosts. We're investigating three ghosts right now. We are looking for the woman in white, uh, the child of the woman in white, and then there's also a, um, a ghost walking on the road over here or something or over here i think which sounds terrifying i don't know if we're gonna see that ghost which i think that ghost has actually been been in the game for like several months now i've just never been able to see it so that is <laughs> some of the ghosts in this game are extremely hard to find but yeah here we are we found the crypts uh the creepy place for sure now, if you don't know the lore about the lady in white, we found a note on her last time we played, and it is a really sad story. So the ghost uh, of the lady in white is called Alice Williams, who uh, was, I think this happened in like the 1940s, so a really long time ago, uh, when obviously women rights were not as uh, spoken about as, as in current year. Uh, so she was married to a verbally abusive man, and she didn't divorce because she couldn't, uh, but she got in love with someone else who actually cared about her, and then <clears throat> she got pregnant from the other man, so not from her husband, the, the abusive husband, and she kept this a secret, obviously, to her uh, abusive husband, but then seven years after the child was born, uh, they had an argument, and in a fit of rage, uh, Alice told, out of spite, the husband that their child wasn't his to, like, hurt him, but then the husband murdered the whole family. <laughs> I mean, I'm laughing because it's so fucked up. Uh, so, and then he disposed of the bodies in the area before the crypts were built. So in this area, he disposed of the bodies and then he just confessed to the crime and uh, handed himself over to the police and he was electrocuted on the electric chair. So yeah, uh, lovely stuff in the 1940s. 
Uh, and now, uh, supposedly, the woman is still walking around looking for her son, and the son is also still looking for the mother. So, there's two ghosts here that are looking for each other, and we are looking for both of the ghosts. So, it uh, should be an interesting, uh, interesting adventure. Let's see if we can find anything. The sound mic. We have so many notes on this. Oh! Oh! We found something! Oh! Come back! Yes! Yes! Oh, no. There she is. There she goes. Stay here. Oh my god, I can't believe it. Found something. Hmm, these temperatures Let's go! are unusual. No, don't go away. Go away. Stay here. This is very cold. Something is Let's go! Alright! Now these EMF? Temperature readings are definitely we found now. the... Oh! Here? Something was there. Wait, where did they go? There was a little EMF. Okay, so we found... We're gonna stay in this area. So this is the area of the lady in white. It's at the front. At the front of the of the crypts. Don't go too far in, because we spend quite some time being too far into the, into the crypt area. And around this one, then. Okay. So here we can get EMF now. We already got two pieces of evidence, which every every piece of evidence is a victory because every piece of evidence is going to increase the overall activity and going to increase our chances to get audio, to get uh, maybe even a ghost photo if we can. Oh boy. Now all we need is EMF and then stuff can start. Lucky, thank you for the five gift subs. Oh, hello? Hi there! Yeah, she is here. She is just chilling at the front. These lights Let's go! I should continue investigating. I'm following? EMF yes! Okay. Okay. This this so we got both the EMF and the temperature, but we haven't seen anything yet, nor have we heard every anything. So it's time to keep our... Uh, it's re it's like exactly here like this this where the tree is you want to just stick in this corner um with the, the grave with this plant on it also beautiful moon i didn't even see that iron, uh, iron loki thank you for the five gift subs thank you thank you guys okay can you talk to me maybe who is can here you tell me your name there's gonna be just a ghost in my face out of nowhere can you tell me your name Why did she never leave? Why didn't you leave, Alice? I mean, maybe because you're finding your son. Which it's so... So, uh, supposedly the son is further down the... Uh, the I'm saying... I want to say asylum every time, but it's the crypts. It's not an asylum, obviously. Um, but they're destined to never meet. What a sad time. Let me take a photo. Or the, the red-eyed red -eyed ghost over here somewhere. What the fuck? I thought that was a ghost, but it's just a weirdly normal statue of a person holding a freaking donut? What are you holding, sir? What the heck? What is that? Is that a cookie? Taking a photo. Putting that in my collection. I don't know what the heck. It's holding half of a burger. Burger. My... My wop. <gasps> oh! Incredible. I captured a ghost on film. That was so short. Did you see it? It was like a tiny, tiny. That was not a lady. That was a boy. That was the child. Oh my god. Wait, I got the photo of the child. What? She, the child was moving towards the front of the, of the crypt. Maybe they're going to meet finally. Because that's supposedly why they're still here. Because they're trying to find each other. Which, how did they not find each other? I've been able to find them. Why can't they find each other? I can lead you there. Follow me, ghost. You want to go to to your mom? It's over here. Let's see if we can find her. And then we can let them lead them to each other. But th I don't think they listen to me because they're... They're, uh... Residuals. But that's going to be so interesting. When they add the exorcism mechanic to this game... And you need to, like, get... So you need to figure out how to get rid of the ghosts. Every ghost could be like a mission. Like these, this could be 
make sure some find some kind of way to get these ghosts to meet and then they can move on to the afterlife together right instead of being lost trying to find each other which that sounds like a really cool way and then the previous episode the demon that killed several families that one could be a, i guess you need to do like a real exorcism there so sometimes it's going to be do something with the ghost sometimes it's going to be uh do an exorcism which this that's gonna be so sick dude <laughs> that's so cool don't know where the hell anything is right now nothing is happening anymore the ghosts have fallen asleep please what's wrong <coughs> what the fuck ah uh, excuse me what was that <laughs> Hello? That gave me freaking goosebumps. <laughs> I was just saying that the ghost didn't do anything anymore. <laughs> and then you scream at me. What the hell? What was that? Oh, was that the death scream? Oh god, that's actually depressing. <laughs> or was the cuz I don't know if the ghost maybe you got scared by me. Did I scare you? I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. I'm a friend. I come in peace. What the hell? That was awesome. The most realistic. This is this right now is the most realistic ghost of the game because nothing is happening. <laughs> it's truly the most realistic ghost of the game ever made, dude. You're just walking around in an empty building and nothing is happening. <laughs> dude, imagine that would be such a fucking troll. Like, real- did you gotta make a game that's called, like, real ghost hunting, and it's just, like, you just walk around in a creepy building and nothing happens. Or, like, you know what? That's actually a really good idea! Like, kind of- instead of a ghost hunting game, you make, like, a- So instead of a ghost hunting game, you make, like, a, uh, a game that is similar to the TV shows, or, like, the- that, that, that do, like, ghost hunting in these, like, old abandoned places that are, like, super, super exa exaggerated and, like, small stuff happens. Like, something falls down and they go, like, oh, my God, it's a ghost. But instead, it's just, like, something falling over. Like, it, like, the, like, an in-between ghost hunting game where it's not sure if it's real or if it's, like, just the wind or something like that and everything could have, like, a natural explanation that would be really cool. Press E to overreact. <laughs> and you grab your night vision, you play some audio, you get like this weird EVP and stuff. I think we're gonna try and... So we, we tried our best to get evidence right now. It's, a, it's just too quiet and apparently according to the dev, basically it'll randomly assign like an activity level to the ghost. So sometimes you're just gonna have a less active ghost than other times. But I... What I think we should do is we should leave and collect evidence on a different ghost like Pierre. Then come over here with a bunch of buffed activity and try to find the lady. Because we saw the boy even though it was a really short photo. But it was definitely not the lady in white. That was a very, like, that was a child for sure. Uh, so let's let's just go to Pierre. Let's say hi to our... I heard a scream. Normal sound? Uh, apparently nothing. Connor's not saying anything. Well, anyway, I'll be back. I'll be right back. Don't go anywhere, you lady in white. I mean, not that you're gonna go anywhere, but don't go anywhere. We're back. And I brought a friend this time. His name is Pierre. Help me out. You want to show yourself? Aki, thank you for the gift sub. We can investigate still both the... Lady in white and the child. Because we have all the notes. We did the whole... Look at the difference. We did almost an entire investigation. Wait. Well, I heard a footstep. We did almost an entire investigation using just one single note on Pierre. Yet we have four different notes on the lady and we cannot find her. God damn it. Alice. You piece of... Can't hear that. Why can't you hear that? If I'm not talking... It doesn't pick it up. I have to talk and interrupt myself. You, you piece of shit. What the hell is going on? Help me. Help. That's so weird. <laughs> My keyboard is possessed. 
not sure. We're gonna give it five minutes. Five minutes? It's already almost longer than the whole investigation on the previous ghost. That's insane. <laughs> what? That was a very unusual noise. That I'll was a that very noise. unusual noise! Screaming! <laughs> I'll keep that as audio evidence. What? What? I heard footsteps. What was that? What the hell? Hello? Terrifying? She's here! And she's crying! Or laughing! Probably crying! But maybe laughing. <laughs> Hopefully laughing. Probably crying. Um, hello? You sound like she came from here. What the hell? Alice? Alice? I'm scared. This is intense. I miss the red eyes. You saw the red eye? Here we go. That's extraordinary. There she is! Evidence. Incredible. I captured a ghost on film. We found her! Finally! Let's go! She's definitely crying, though. Let's go, dude! We did it! <laughs> Finally! Oh, she's still walking! Oh, she just stops periodically to cry. So, so yeah, if you're having trouble finding this ghost, definitely super useful to leave the investigation and then come back. Is she gonna go here? Yep. She's coming for me. What the heck, man? That's a screenshot right there. <laughs> we finally found her. Screenshots! Crying, though. Because you can't find her son? How long does she keep walking? Oh, did she stop? Or she's there? Oh, she's still going! But yeah, you can just- she just, like, walks forever. But you need to find your son. Wait, can we can we somehow unite? I don't think that's not in the game yet. But imagine in the future when you can unite them somehow. So can I get more audio? That's really cool. We need to find the kid. That's extraordinary. Oh, we got the crying again. Nice. I mean, look at my investigation. I've did an outstanding, outstanding amount of evidence. I think the ghost is gone now. I think so. Yes, okay. Well, we found the lady in white. That's incredible. Actually, so long, too. That is... That, I'm glad it was not just an, a burst of a... Like, we didn't see her for, like, one second after working so hard to find her. But now the question is, will the boy be there, too? Will they... Is that... Because she's, like, walking around, looking around. The boy was only, like, there for a split second. Because I know they're in different areas of the... Of the crypts, because otherwise, obviously, they would find each other. Hello, boy? Are you here? That was really cool. Bring them together. I wish you could do that. Like, lead them somehow? Lead the lady by playing audio from... I could say, boy. <laughs> oh, yeah, mate! No, no, no. <laughs> I see what you mean. You can play the audio of the child. Wait! Wow, I, I took a photo of a ghost. Hi there! But he was like zombie moding. Wait, did you see that? Where'd he go? He was like running like this, like zombie, and then he disappeared. Or then he stopped doing that. Wait, that was sick. We found both of them! So yeah, it's extremely important to if you if you're having trouble finding them. Like, you could do the investigate one ghost and then pivot strat, and you could also just leave and come back later, because it seems like they're more active sometimes. And other times they're less active. It's like, it's random. That's why sometimes you get the craziest demon, and sometimes you can't get any evidence at all. Man, that was crazy. Now, can we get any audio, though, or is that just... I think odd... I think these ghosts might... Like, they want to show themselves more than they want to talk to me. Even though we could probably get the footsteps of this guy, but I don't think that's going to help much. That was really cool. So, they're... So... If you want to investigate this for yourself to get the trophy of them, 
you're looking for this area, this area at the back. So right now, I'm at the back uh, right corner of the of the crypts. That's where the boy is, and the and the lady in white is at the front, front le uh, front left basically. So they're like complete opposite sides of the crypts, and they don't ever meet because that's the thing. That's why they're still here because they they're looking for each other. Now, what would be really cool is if, for example, in the future, you can like play. You do an investigation on the boy, you get like a, a mom, where are you voice log or something, and then you can play that back to, at the lady in white to lead her to the boy. And then they meet, and then the spirit like goes up in like a, a white glow, and then they disappear. Like, imagine, dude. Imagine the goal of Conrad Stevens' Paranormal PI is to go to this town and then at the end of the game, nothing is haunted anymore. All of the ghosts are gone and it's just a completely normal town and you can still go to places, but there's just nothing there. That'd be so cool if the goal of the game, I mean, obviously you would need to have like settings to be able to like reinvestigate them, like to, to get them back. Because otherwise you could like disable the game. You could like create... Like, remove all the ghosts from the game and then you can't play it anymore. But that actually sounds like a really cool, really cool game. Like, a campaign for a single player. Like, the goal is to get rid of all the ghosts in the town. And then you're gonna be, like, the hero of the town. You saved everyone. And every ghost is, like, a different puzzle. You have to figure out, like, why they're there and how they could possibly be. Like, it's not gonna be, like, hand-holdy. You will have to figure out how to... How to like exercise them in each in their own way like if they're all a puzzle it's like a puzzle game a puzzle ghost hunting game where you have to like investigate each ghost get their lore and then use that information to exercise them that sounds so cool <laughs> there is different maps there is different maps and oh yeah like a different area where you can go i mean that's kind of the same idea right i don't think that i mean the lady was walking so that's, that's, that, oh, my. Wait, is she on top of me? I think she's on top of me. I think she's walking right here, but she's invisible. Yeah. I think she is. She's invisible. I can I can lead you to, to your child, ghost. She's right there. <laughs> this is terrifying. Don't cry. No. And she's very sad. What the fuck? That is so cool. I wonder what kind of audio evidence these 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 ghosts have. So what, what I did there, by the way, if you get too close to a to a residual, they will disappear. So I might have gotten too close by accident because obviously I didn't know. And then she disappeared. She's still here. You just can't see her. I still if you if you play Conrad Stevens's Paranormal PI yourself, I would love to know if you've ever been able to investigate the red eyes. According to people, the red eyes will be in this area. There's a whole ghost that I have never seen at all. So I have genuinely no idea how they look like, how to investigate them. If you wanna like if you have any tips on finding that ghost, you could let me know. I would love to investigate that one but that this is super cool that was the lady in white we it took us uh, blood sweat and tears but we finally found them uh we did actually a full investigation on them and everything so now we can get a golden trophy and we can finally put a pin in the lady in white story until uh maybe because i know they're gonna change some more maybe the lady in white will become even more crazy and then we can collect more audio evidence uh but let's let's see let's let's complete this quest and, and see if we get the golden trophy and Yes, let's go. A full golden trophy investigation on the lady in white. Now let's go to the map and see how close we are to like finalizing these. Because we should have for the... Because I don't know if the chat was on this board before.
Let's look how many freaking ghosts there are, because we're still missing the lady in white, right? Look at that! The lady in white! We actually got four out of five audio logs, so we need to listen to that. <laughs> Why the fuck? Look at the boy. <laughs> Why is he fucking shaking like that? <laughs> what the hell? And then Lefebvre, Le we still need the... So, yeah, the only ghost... Wait, no, but the shadow! We haven't investigated the shadow after they added this system. Because the shadow isn't on here. So we need to investigate the shadow, and we also need to investigate so many of these. Because all, all of these ghosts in the old maps we haven't really properly investigated yet on the new system, where they had, like, the achievements, and you could, um... Uh, like, you could keep notes on how many of the audio you collected of each ghost. But let's listen to them, because apparently we got some... We got almost- we got four different audio logs. Uh, woman in white, here we go. <laughs> yeah, that's the crying. <laughs> Bad times. Okay. <laughs> that's also crying, that's also not very good. Why is she always crying? <laughs> He's always sad. What the heck? Oh! Is it mommy or is it... I don't think I hear the M. Is she saying the name of the child? I don't know what she... Honey? Tommy? Tommy? Or Honey? Honey, maybe? Because I don't think we know the name of the child. Do we have the, any audio on the boy? No, I don't think we do. I don't think we have audio. Wait, do we? How much audio is there on the boy? So there's definitely more to find here, but I've already spoken to the dev and he's gonna change them to make the ghost even more active. So yeah. Oh no, there's no audio on the boy. Because it would say... Zero out of X, but no. So there's no audio. So we did a full-on investigation on the boy, and we almost did a perfect investigation on the lady in white. So I'm gonna say we did a great job. I did that so you don't have to. We finally found the lady in white, which is not a very happy story. Uh, given, <laughs> I don't know if you remember what I said, uh, how the the husband killed the, the woman and the child and then freaking dumped their body in the... in the... this one. They dumped the body in the in the crypts but yeah anyway that is gonna be it for the lady in white i hope you enjoyed that one tough investigation but we found her finally i hope you enjoyed the video if you're not subscribed please do so if you like the video like it if you dislike it dislike it and if you want to join the lovely gamers over here in chat you can join us over at twitch.tv slash insim every single day at 7 p.m Central you pm time thank you very much for watching if you want to watch more connor Stevens is paranormal pi there's a playlist over in the top right you can watch all the episodes which especially the last few episodes have been really closely connected with every episode kind of building on the last one or and and also the especially the last one where we found a very crazy score story so i highly recommend that one hope you enjoyed this one if you're not subscribed oh wait i already said that right i'm, just, I'm a little sleepy today <laughs> bye guys have a good one bye guys subscribe subscribe double subscribe Sub don't click the subscribe button again if you're already subscribed though because that's gonna that's gonna lead to bad things don't do that click it three times if you do that anyway bye <laughs>